welcome back to my channel so today I'm actually going to be using one of the masks that I got from my gift exchange I already washed my face now I have not done a skincare video in a while now because I feel like I'm just trying to learn the best products that work for my skin there's some products that I've tried and I'm like okay this may work and then there's some products that I've tried to where I'm just like no it's not it so that's one of the reasons why I haven't been doing skincare videos I think I did a shorts but even so, some of those products, I feel like after I use them, I won't consider them as a staple. But anyway, so this pro this mask I got from the gift exchange that we got. This was one of the masks. And sometimes I normally keep this for tra these type of masks for like traveling or something. But I really was curious to try this one today. So my normal mask, so that's why. Um, I did see this. I've seen this brand before, but I've never tried them before. This is the new Yes to... Yes to Tomato Clear Skin for All Skin Types Anti Pollution Detoxifying Charcoal Bubbling Paper Mask. Yes to Bubbling Up with the Latest LBM Little Black Mask with Charcoal and Oxygen to Help Lift Away the Nasties and Rid of Pesky Pollutants. It's a one single use paper mask, and this is what it looks like. So how to use, I'm supposed to gently unfold mask and apply it to clean skin, adjust around eyes, nose, and mouth, smoothing to fit the curves of your George's face, magically ma watch the bubbles appear, and then close eyes and relax for 10 minutes and remove mask. So normally I would do this, I would do a mask after shower, but just for today I just felt like I'll wash my face and do it now and then just rinse it out in the shower. Um, so yeah. They said this has no parabens. SLS or silicone so they say and their first ingredient is actually olive leaf barb I can never say that word leaf juice well the mask smells really good every time I get these masks I feel like I'm about to make a mess with them because they always have that extra liquid in the packaging and it just yeah so I'm just gonna go ahead so this is what it looks like like a what just like a black paper mask like I said, it smells really good. I'm just going to gently open it up so that I can apply it. So it's very seldom that I use a sheet mask. Sometimes I have a few sheet masks that I've used, but normally they're actually like masks that either I got for free to try in a box or something like that. But the masks that I normally buy for myself are like, they're never normally sheet masks, so. So, hold on, I'm trying to figure out where eyes, okay, this is for your eyes. This is the eye part, your nose, and your mouth, okay. You guys know, I, 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 mean, I wear glasses, so, and I got no mirror in front of me, so we're just going to do this, and hopefully I don't blind myself. Okay, I feel like... I need to go in front of a mirror and do this correctly because I feel like I'm doing this so incorrectly because I can't see. I don't have the mirror next to me. It feels like I have this correct, but who knows? Hold on. I'm about to check. The mask is really soapy. I feel like it's still on my lip. Alexa, put a time for 10 minutes. 10 minutes. Starting now. Okay. I can't talk. So my thoughts on this mask is it's okay so first of all I couldn't read anything because uh, it was so soapy that bubbly and soapy that it was in my in my nostrils so I was like I'm just gonna cut the camera off now and I'll probably leave some of the footage because I look crazy even though I just did like up and down or like side to side to kind of like not get in my eyes or get it into my nose like it was still it is what it is um so, I didn't finish telling you guys the ingredients because I couldn't talk anymore, but there, the ingredients is aloe, barbonic, leaf juice, uh, I can't read any of these things, but I'll leave the mask down below. You guys, I don't try, sometimes I try not to read ingredients because then I just end up messing up with the pronunciation. But, um, I will say that I did like that I made, like, 
kept my face really clean. I do like the soapy soapiness because I felt like it was kind of like another cleanser after I cleaned my face. But I don't think this, um, just for the bubbling portion, I, I don't know. Is that's my only con? Too much bubbles. Like my face was just was all over. I felt like it was getting it was getting my eyes. So that's the only like, con for me. I think the bubbling part, the bubbles, because it's just like all over. But I will give it a thumbs up for actually like make my face feel clean. Like after I washed my face, it felt nice. I will say that. So yeah. But yeah, that's how I felt about this. Yes, to, um, tomatoes. The only thing, my only advice for them was to lessen the number, the the amount of bubbles you put into the mask. Cause I was looking crazy. But other than that, that's all for my review on this mask. Make sure you like, you comment, subscribe. Hit the notification bell next to the subscribe button so that you're notified every time I post a new video. And I'll see you guys in the next one.